What's good, y'all? It's your boy J. Brock is clap it up, LA. You know what I'm saying? I'm right here with the homie Janky of Y L S T E. Yes, and you already sir. know he dropping in fire stuff. How you feeling today, bro? I'm good, man. Yeah. Performance was lit. Man, how was that performance for you? I, I'm drained. You know what I'm saying? How, how you feeling, man? Nah, it was more the drive, man. Yeah. I, had to, I was coming from like Riverside just now. Oh, you had a push? Uh, yeah. But it's all good, man. Yeah. We made it. We hey. all in good health. As long as you're doing what you love, you gotta do what you gotta do now. Now, um, I, I know you involved with Schoolboy Q. Yes, sir. So how did that even start, and, and what type of game do you get from Schoolboy Q? I mean, I be in the studio with bro like every day. Mm -hmm. So you be in there with butter? Yeah, that's my boy. That's my boy. I want to kiss him. I'm gonna top it up with him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think yeah. that should be back on Monday. I'm gonna yeah. top it up with him. Bobby. Yeah, I'm gonna see what he. You feel me? Yeah, that's my boy. But yeah. Man. Butter, my, my big bro. I'm trying to get him to shoot me a video. Oh, you know, bro, he's different. <laughs> hey, yeah, he hey, Butter want what he want. If you don't give him that, he ain't. <laughs> Shout out Butter, though, man, man for real, doing his thing. Him, that's big yeah. bro. Yeah, so, I mean, so what is the energy like when y'all in the studio? Because I see that he's in the studio a whole lot. What's the yeah, energy like? it's like every day, Monday through yeah. Friday. It's crazy. Like, yeah. every day in summer, you feel me? Yeah. It's not like, you feel me, you go to the studio, and, you feel me? Like, I don't know if, if you've been to a, a, a studio with an artist every day. Yeah. It's, like, kind of repetitive. Yeah. It's, it's nothing like that. It's the same. Bro. Okay. Bro, it's nothing like that. You yeah. never know what to expect with Q. Right, right. Like, so, so, so what type of... What do you? What have you learned about his game that you have applied in your own game? Um, it's really more or less his um, his like recording process. Okay. Like all the, all the people you just seen me with coming yeah. here with like probably like seventy five percent of them was producers. Wow. So he had been a. Um, I don't want to be telling how his no, process, cool. but yeah, yeah. you feel me? He be in the studio with like five, six niggas, well, producers, and then he be on the mic, and they be cooking up, you feel yeah. me, while he rapping, and then he be telling them like, oh, nah, I don't want that, I, don't, I do want this, so mm. it was it was more like more uh, not, you feel me, getting a beat, and yeah. you feel me, rapping over it, but mm. creating the music right. together, gotcha, you feel gotcha, me? Gotcha, so gotcha, that's gotcha. where I really, you feel me? That's where you feel me. He, you feel me? Yeah, teaching yeah. me how to make music. Right, right, right. right, right. right, right. Got that, got that. So, yeah. what got you started? You know, what um, made you step into and wanting to rap? Really, it was like, uh, well, I was balling, and then I tore my ACL. Okay, football? So it was, yeah. Okay. It, okay. it was over. You feel yeah. me? So, I had to look for something else to do around that same time. One of the OGs from my hood, well, he was um, he was rapping, but he got into a car crash. Okay. He, he, his car caught on fire, he burned, and... Me, mm. yeah, yeah, okay. me? Yeah. And that was like one of my biggest inspirations right there. His name mm. Tiny M. Oh man, okay. Well, sometimes it's like tragic situations that make us make those Absolutely. decisions. Absolutely. A lot of yeah. tragic situations can yeah. be going. Yeah, that's right. It's sad to say, but that's, that's I mean, but you know what? Yeah, the facts. Once we find our motivation, you know what you're doing this for. You know what I'm saying? Absolutely. So do you feel like 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 music is really what you love to do? Oh, okay, let's take it back because I play football too. Yeah. When football was over, like a lot of people don't know, as athletes, we can go into a deep, dark place. Because that's the sure. only thing we can identify with that we love. Absolutely. So would you say that football was like the, that thing for you that you completely love? Definitely. Yeah. It's like if you love a girl, you feel me? And then you feel me? It's over. It ended bad. But you get another one that's probably bad or you feel right. me? So it's like, oh. That's your first love. You got to find the next best thing. Exactly. Come on. Exactly. Like, that's yeah. your first love, but yeah. you feel me? That ain't yeah. going to work. You know yeah. what you feel me? I feel that. Not even like a rebound, but yeah. you fell in love again. Yeah, I feel that. So, <laughs> yeah. what is your process like in making music? When you hear a beat, how long does it typically take you? Or, or are you punching in? Or are you writing what you, what you got um, doing? As far as writing, it would probably take me like 20 minutes to write mm -hmm. a verse. Yeah. And because uh, I write everything, but I'm you feel me? I've been doing it for so long, I don't like freestyling. Yeah, I like to say the most creative shit I can come up with. You feel mm -hmm. me? I don't like just off the top, that's just me though. Mm -hmm. But as far as recording, I used to try to one take everything, mm -hmm. but I had a talk with Q and Kendrick, they had sat me down. He said yeah. Kendrick, Ooh. man, boy, yeah. that was, that was okay. for me too. Yeah, 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 yeah. But they was just basically not so much as critiquing my style, but just. Yeah, yeah, saying what they would want out of an artist, you mm -hmm. feel me? Mm -hmm. So they were basically giving me game. I feel that. I feel that. So and you got to take me that it's game. More, exactly. Yeah. So, you feel me? Not everybody can sit down and have a combo with Kenny. Facts. You feel me? So yeah. it's like, you feel me? Let alone Q, but. That's a, me, that's a me and other conversation. Come on, man. Come on. So I didn't yeah. feel me? So yeah. he was just telling me it's more when you rapping and expressing yourself. Like, you feel me? It ain't about, like, you feel me? trying to say everything mm -hmm. like say everything with clarity mm -hmm. make sure you feel me if this what you want to do it ain't just about sounding cool 
It's about, you feel me, making the music sound good. You feel me? It's not just, you feel me? So that makes you, so... So that would make you. So that would make you come with more of a message. Yeah, definitely. You know, instead, instead of the fluff. Definitely, it's, okay. it's, 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 it's messages within my music. You mm-hmm. feel me? People take what they take out of it, but yeah. I feel like it's way deeper than what you feel me. What meets eye. If you really listen yeah. to what I'm talking about. Yeah. We'll see. That's we'll see, we'll see. That's the great thing about like doing interviews because you give people that perspective. Definitely. Compared to if they didn't have that, now they understand. You got to listen to the music for a deeper message. So, I got to ask you. Uh, what are you working on? What can we expect in 2022? Um, give us something. What we got? Last year, I, I dropped like probably six, seven projects. Sheesh. Yeah. Busy. Yeah. So this one, this year, I'm probably going to try to slow it down. Mm-hmm. I, I want to do major projects. Mm-hmm. I'm going to do, uh, I, I told Cypress I want to drop in February, mm-hmm. but he said he got something dropping in February. So whenever Cypress is ready, that's, that's okay. going to be my next Yeah, job. okay. All right, yeah. So, hey, that's coming soon. Yeah, that's what you're doing. <laughs> hey, yeah, yeah. You, you, part of that too. Yeah, so, that's coming yeah. soon. That's so coming soon. Whenever we get on top of that, we got like five tracks done. Yeah. One but, more. You feel me? We back. probably gonna get like 10, 12 done and pick out, out of that. You feel me? I don't know how many he trying to put on there. Yeah. But, Whatever um, the case is, yeah. it's gonna be five. But yeah, that's that's yeah. A, the, uh, we naming that, I believe, Extreme Measures. Extreme Measures. Yes, okay. Is, 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 was that your idea to name it Extreme? Okay, why Why Extreme Measures? Because I made a song with my boy Earl Swavy. Yeah. The one who uh, just recently passed. Rest in peace. Yeah. And that was basically the, uh, the track I set the bar off of. Okay. It's not called uh, Extreme Measures, but I said, uh, said something in the song like they said we wouldn't go far we took it to extreme measures mm-hmm. you know, so, so mm-hmm. I, I was kind of i was feeling that okay i got you i got you but one thing i gotta say you have a very unique voice yeah, that, you have a musical voice you know what i'm saying so whatever you got going bro just keep guessing yeah, now so i gotta yeah. ask you what is it that you clap it up for when you look at where you stand in the day and, and everything you've been through in your life um shit, the fact that i'm still breathing mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm still being able to take care of my son. He just turned three. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, the fact that I'm doing shit like what I be doing, as far as, you feel me, putting him in Balenciaga, taking him to, you feel me, Disneyland trips, like That's I just right. did for his third birthday. Yeah. That type of shit, making sure my son don't live the life that I live. That's right. Like, That's, That's right. what I, I clap it up for, yeah. as far as me being a young black, you feel me, male. No, facts, facts, facts. The best thing that any of us can do is be a father to our children. Exactly. That's off top. So, you know what I'm saying? Right here with my boy Janky of LSTE. Make sure you tap into his music and everything he got coming. Yes, and best believe he's going to be dropping fire, fire, fire. Some yes, more fire. Sir. It's your boy J. Brock. Clap it up, LA. We out. Shout out, clap it up. Yes, sir.